So till now we have seen how to create objects from, from the classes that we have defined. Sometimes classes will be defined in a package and we will have to import that class and create an object of it. We will see an example. So we are going to use turtle here. So turtle is a package available in Python. You don't have to separately install it. It is directly available in Python. And it is used for doing graphic related work. And we are going to design games using Python in the future classes. So we will see introduction of, of this in, the, in this particular lecture. So you can imagine a turtle as an actual turtle carrying a paintbrush. And if the turtle moves forward or backward, whatever, whatever color is in the paintbrush, that line will be drawn. This is very basic, but later we will try to modify it and do several other things by like doing games and all. Now there is turtle documentation. If you want to know more about turtle, then you can go to turtle documentation in Python docs, docs.python.org. And there are various methods available in turtle. Okay, so there are various methods available there. So entire tutorial is given here. Anyway, we are going to uh, do all these methods, most of the methods in our classes. So as and when required, I'll show you the methods, what are there, whatever are there in, in the turtle. And also you can change the color of the turtle. Uh, and there is, you can go to a website called wellesley.edu where you can get the colors, all the colors that are available for the turtle. So using these colors, you can actually uh, paint on the canvas. Canvas means the screen. Okay. So let's now see a small program here. Let's try to import turtle. So inside the turtle package, there is turtle class. So if you see this, turtle is the package name and turtle class is available. C is there. You can see C which means turtle is a class with capital T, Pascal case. Now we are actually creating an object. How do you create an object? By putting parentheses. By putting parentheses around after the turtle, we are creating an object called Tommy. And now instead of importing only turtle, you can import directly turtle class so that you don't have to write turtle.turtle at always. You can directly import from turtle, you can import turtle class. And here you don't have to give the package name, you can directly give turtle. Now, if you try to print it, print Tommy. You can see that a screen has come and it disappeared, right? Run it again. A screen has come and it is it is disappearing. We have to catch hold of the screen of the screen. We will do that. Now when I'm printing Tommy in the in the output, it is showing that turtle object at so and so memory location, which means Tommy is an object here. Okay, we we got hold of the object. Now let's try to get hold of the screen. So there is one more class called screen. Now, as you know, the classes also have attributes. When you create an object of the class, you can access the attributes. So I'm creating one more new object called my screen, which is an object of the class screen. Now we can actually access the attributes of screen. canvas height so we can print it <clears throat> okay again you can see the screen has come and it, it disappeared and the canvas height is 300 okay so 300 pixels is the height of the canvas now let's try to see that the canvas doesn't disappear until we click okay so there is a method available on screen. Again, go to the documentation. How do I know all these methods from the documentation? Go to the documentation, you'll get it. So my screen, 
on the on the on the class screen there is a method available for click on exit now if you run it the screen is there and only when you click it will disappear okay so this is the turtle symbol so this is the turtle symbol you are seeing okay now i want to change the shape of the turtle into actual turtle by default an arrow mark is given i want to change the turtle size turtle to actual turtle so on the turtle class there is a method available called shape using the shape i am trying to change the shape to turtle go to the documentation you will see all these methods now here we have turtle now let's try to move it let's try to move the turtle and also set the color of turtle first so again there is a method called color and now if i set the color to red the paint brush color will be red and let's try to move it forward now the color of turtle has changed to red let's try to move it so dot forward is there i have shown you that method i am moving it 100 paces the height and width is 300 300 i am moving it 100 paces so it has moved 100 okay so you can see that it is moving okay thank you